Hello everybody, my name is CT Dax and welcome back to another video. We got some exciting news guys. Patch 4.5 is out. The Neo Volkite pistol has dropped. Finally, yes, new weapons. We love the sound of this, we want more. So, I've done some testing with this weapon already. It's fun. It's a big laser beam. Builds up charge over time and eventually detonates his enemies around it. Feels pretty cool, but I will ward people. When you first start using it, lower levels, obviously he's going to be weak, like every other gun when you start out with. Also, you're going to fly through ammo, like a lot. But that's okay, because uh, I plan to put in some more time with it. Hopefully, once you get to max level, it just shreds. That's the hope, especially for it being a new weapon. There's a, lot, there's a lot riding on this kind of stuff. But with patch 4.5, there's also some new updates as well. We've got the uh, balancing tweaks for weapons in only in operations. So currently uh, in story mode and PVP, nothing has been changed as far as we can tell, but the plasma incinerator has had a little bit of work done to it as well. The bolt sniper rifle, the Oculus bolt cut. That has to be misspelling, right? Carabine, but oh, okay. I thought it was carbine, but maybe I'm crazy. So Oculus bolt carbine, the, the, the standard SMG bolt carbine, and the auto bolt rifle, they all had work done to them as well. Also, we have a number of general fixes, like they fixed a bug causing unlocked DLC cosmetic items to be locked again after a restart, fixed a bug with the sniper perk target shot to not work after swapping weapons, sniper invisibility not getting removed after shot in rare cases, uh, bug preventing players from muting and others in PvP, several perks not triggering correctly in enemy kills, and a bug that prevented certain weapon posts from triggering correctly when reaching a specific HP threshold. Also some basic tech improvements as well. Crash fixes, general stability, fixed server disconnects, that's double user connection, and general connectivity improvements. So this is all sounding like good stuff. So like, we love the fact that we got a new weapon. Some other weapons have been tweaked a little bit. So hopefully we won't have to wait too much longer and we get the Dark Angels DLC, which I personally, I'm just looking forward to. Dark Angels, they're awesome. They look badass. So yes, just to reiterate, uh, the, the Neo Pistol currently is only available for use for the Assault, the Vanguard, and the Bulwark. So remember, if you're running Bulwark, we struggle enough when we have flyers to deal with, so don't burn through all your ammo immediately on the little guys, because you're going to need it. But that's it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for everyone coming in and hanging out. Uh, we've got more videos coming. I've got, I'm currently working on the review for Space Marine 2. I know it's, it's pretty late, but you know, we get there eventually. So thank you very much for watching this. I hope everyone has a great rest of the week. I'll catch you in the next one. Turtles.